took me an hour and 10 minutes to do my piano. Oh, this one has two pockets on this side too. $500 is steep. So this is a kagami mochi, which is this mochi Kagami means mirror in Japanese. I forgot what the significance is, but you display this in a Japanese home for New Year's. But my sister said on the 11th of January, you're supposed to eat it. And this is an ox because 2021 is a year of an ox. I was like, why is there a cow there randomly? Now I just figured it out. And this is jittery. It's Wednesday! And I just finished my PLs for December. It's like almost two weeks into January, and I finally did my PLs. I've been putting it off for way too long. And $700 alone on my dental procedures. And I think that's because it took me an hour and 10 minutes to do my PLs. And that is a lot longer than I had expected. I mean, moving forward, it is just an hour to get a full snapshot of how my business is doing. So it's whatever, it's not that big of a deal, but yeah, because I'm not really used to doing like computer work anymore. Like I used to do like computer work for eight hours a day, 10 hours a day. And as a forensic economist, you just look at people's earning statements all day long or like a business p and all day long and come up with something. So it was just, it was just, it was like, I didn't really tolerate, I didn't really mind it, you know? It was just kind of like, a lot of it was brainless data entry until I got to the part where I have to think of something, think of some kind of conclusion, some kind of thing to defend. <sighs> anyway, long story short, finished my P&L. Am I happy with my net earnings? No, but I also am aware of the fact that you know, I had a lot of expenses last month, but hopefully it will be better in January. I have never done this before. First time doing car wash. So you just choose that and then you change it around and you stop. Why am I so afraid just to say a hello? Now you do this one. This is the first time I've ever watched my car like this. The shit and fill you in were reminiscent. Yeah. <laughs> All the dumb things we did when we were only little children. Up in the hill smoking cigarettes, waiting on a vision. Of what our life would be like if we were dreaming in together. Good. All oh, that stuff is gone. All oh, the poop is gone. Especially from the top. Ah. Oh, look. Getting this again. More bits. Finally buying a car. A few days ago, or maybe like a week ago or something, I was talking about getting some kind of apron because my pant pockets, it's so hard to find drill bits from there when I'm like on the ladder, hanging something, holding something. And so instead of designing or creating, I purchased a couple to try on. So there's this one. And this one was like about $15. They're both from Amazon. But this one is from Arsenal Equipment Storage Systems. And it has like the clips there. Oh wait, it's just actually, so this part I can't adjust and it's like thick band. And then this part I can't adjust. I'm gonna make it the smallest, hold on. So it's like this, right? I got pockets here, pocket, 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 smaller pockets here and for like pens and pockets here. And then I got the straps to put my drill if I wanted to. And 
I guess I could even make it lower if I wanted to. But this is as small as it gets. Because I don't want it to be like super wide. I want it as close to my body. Hmm. What do you think? Don't really care for the color, but it has a lot of compartments, so I like that. So there's that one. This one is from Dickies, and this one was $19. It's thinner, which I kind of like better just because it's like a softer material, but it's, it still feels pretty durable. This one looks like. Same amount of pockets actually, but I like that it's all black rather than that one. But actually that one feels stronger and better quality than Dickies, even though this is more expensive. Weird. Um, yeah, this one has one pocket. This one has two. Oh, this one has two pockets on this side too. It's exactly the same, except this is like a more I don't know. I feel like this is thicker. And this, I have this contraption here too. I don't know. I guess they're exactly the same. And I also got the compact. They only give you one battery for this thing. I did a demo with this. So I just have some random drill bit that came with this container. It has just like assortment of screws. That's actually really shitty quality screws. I do not recommend. I broke the heads of these screws all the time. So I just stick this a short bit in here. It's not gonna pop out. And then I'm gonna grab just any screw. The heck? Wow, I didn't even have to drill a hole first. Amazing. Cool. Amazing. Wow. Now let's take out the screws. Just got done with my test. It was so quick. I've never been on this um, Cal State campus before. Oh, it's a statue of Confucius. Confucius? Confucius. <laughs> cool. It's 3.46 on a Friday and it is dead at this school because of COVID. Today is Saturday and I just worked one job and I drilled into brick 20 times and brick essentially if you chip at it is like powder right but somehow look what I did Do you see it look what I did to the masonry bit it's flat I don't know what I hit but it's flat I don't know why this keeps happening to me. <laughs> why do I suck so bad? <laughs>
<gasps> I'm totally gonna cook this clean plate, clean eating menu with tofu on a wheat bread. I've never had it that way. I'm at the grocery store right now and I'm gonna pick up everything I need and I will show you how it turns out. I'm really happy. So I'm only taking one job today and it was to put together a TV console, but I also hung up these like ceramic squares, decorative square thingies. Anyway, I used the compact this time because you can't use the compact drill, as I was saying, because you can't use the compact drill to assemble IKEA furniture or any furniture for that matter because it's just gonna drill right through it because it's pre-assembled or not pre-assembled but it's like pre-drilled already anyway so I was like since picking it up on Wednesday and working Thursday Friday Saturday and today I didn't really use the compact drill so I was like maybe for me as like a mobile handy woman it's not the most smart business expense, I guess. It's not really a tool that I'm gonna use consistently. And I know that I will need it in the future, but if I'm carrying two drills around, I wanna make sure, make sure, make sure I'm using both of them. So I was thinking of returning it, but it was actually really useful to use to hang those cubes instead of drilling into a hole every single time with a actual drill bit, like actual drilling drill bit. So I might keep it, I'm gonna wait for about a month or so because they have a 30 or 90 day return policy at Lowe's anyway. But yeah, I think that's the end of this week's Handy Woman Diaries. I'm gonna keep the compact drill. And also, I am getting a tax, I'm praying for a tax service to file my taxes correctly for the year 2020. And because I have an S corporation, she's gonna be $500 and then she's, I'm also gonna have her file on personal taxes and that's gonna be $175 minimum. So is that normal? I don't know. Like people online really don't talk about how they file their taxes. So who knows, but uh, I will let you know how it goes. So far I have to send her a bunch of things. Uh, I'm filling out this like organizer form for her, which basically looks like a schedule K, which is a per, pros, pa, profit and loss form that the IRS has. So I'm filling out everything like a rough draft of my actual business return and I'll let you know how things go because $500 is steep. I've never paid that much for tax services. I think the most I've ever paid was like a hundred dollars um h and block or something but anyway i will let you know thank you so much for watching this handy woman diaries video i will see you in my next video which should be a review of tax rabbit from a tasker 2021 updated version and then i also want to film a updated what's in my tool bag video because i'm sticking to the cobalt um tool bag from lowe's and follow me on Instagram for daily updates. It is at my kind of economical. Peace.